Um, I know a lot of people will be quick to remind us that Usliman scored um, 26 goals in the um, Serie A last season, and then he won them the Scudetto for the first time in almost three decades. You know, but then again, we've seen it time and time and time again that he needs to do better with his composure mm. when it comes to finishing. Yeah, he topped the qualifiers, you know, with 10 goals and all of that, but we've seen him lose chances that he should be putting away against uh, uh, Equatorial Guinea in the first game yeah. he had like four big glaring chances, chances glaring chances not to talk of the golden one he will be fed in with you know so he needs to do better against Ghana the World Cup qualifiers I mean he had some good chances as well you know but then take nothing from him what he lacks in his finishing he makes up for with his presence you know with his fighting spirit with you know tiring out the defenders and then that's the reason why his supporting strikers need to play close to him because when he tires them out you are left with little or no other work to do as a supporting striker than to just come and finish the work mm -hmm. you know if not for the penalty i think Mola Lukman would probably have benefited from that fight from uh, uh, victor usimen mm -hmm. but then again usimen has got to make just calm down a little bit and get to finish i mean he's a, he's a clinical striker and um, i think it's something that with time he will get to bury these chances as they come and mike this was one that nigeria considered against uh, equatorial